Hello everyone, it's me again, GW fan the softcore brony, and this is the amazing Lauren Faust on Let's Play My Little Pony Fantasy 6. Yeah, we got Faust. I recruited her first thing, and something I realize I haven't uh, mentioned yet. Uh, every character that joins you uh, at, in the world of Ruin is going to ha have their level average to whatever level the you know all your currently recruited characters have. There we go, and with only two exceptions. One of those being Lauren Faust, or just Faust, uh, who will be two levels higher than whatever the party average is. Uh, apparently, Rainbow Dash was just short of getting to level 29, so our party average was 28 when we recruited her, which is why she's only at level 30. So, yeah, let's get her in the party real quick. Uh, I'll put her with uh, these three for the moment. Uh, okay, today is all about Faust. But first, here's the airship. And uh, basically, Faust was down there if you need to talk to her uh, for some reason. And then we have this character who's the same as always, those not now in our party, Rainbow Dash. Lost her equipment. Aw. Anyway, Faust! Yay! Faust, really awesome character. Now you're in the back row. There we go. Okay, everyone else is in the back row. So, let's see. First thing, let's talk about Faust. Talk about her, look at her stats. And, uh, oh. Look at that. Oh, by the way, something I, I actually only just recently noticed. Uh, every character's battle power uh, somewhere after version point... Uh, Point nine eight uh, was reduced a little bit because uh, you know their regular battle power was higher than some of the early game weapons and all. Anyway, Faust stats they're very very impressive. Almost every stat is way higher than Gogo's, uh, with you know the only exception being defense, which is the same. But yeah, Faust is actually has really good stats. She's built to be a mage, and is actually the uh, uh, the second weakest mage, really, because with a uh, magic power only one point less than Celestia's. But that doesn't go against her at all. She's a very effective character. In fact, I actually will go as far as to say she may very well be the best character in the game. So, before I go over why she's really that good, which I'm basically going to be explaining the whole time, let's go over her main ability here, Mimic. This is a really good ability. Whatever, whenever you use it, she will use whatever the last characters uh, who w uh, went use. So, if she, if, uh, you know, Trixie used Unicorn, she'll use Unicorn. If Celestia used Fire 2, she'll use Fire 2. Best thing about that with Mimic is that if you know, for example, you did you uh, she did ca uh, mimic fire two or golem. She'll use it without using any MP. So she you know has unlimited use of uh, magic ability so long as every other character doesn't run out. Another interesting thing about it is uh, she'll she'll very she'll use very specific abilities when she mimics. So for example, if Scootaloo uses her dance. Whatever specific dance move, like, uh, you know, Sunbath, for example, Faust will mimic that exact ability. Now, you'll notice I have a cursor here, and she has three empty slots. That's because if you press the Accept button, you have access to all this stuff. Holy crud, that's awesome. She can actually equip any of these abilities. Oh, uh, you'll right away, she, and also Gogo -Go also, in the original game, do not have access to uh, Morph, Shock, Health, or, of course, the Magitek command, except in a certain case. But anyway, uh, if you have a keen eye, you'll also notice that she's missing three other abilities, which has been that way as of version 1.0. She does not have access to Summon, Stare, or Gamble slash GP Rain. Uh, summon didn't really matter because Faust is not able to equip Espers. Anyway, so, you know, it was a totally pointless move. Uh, Stare, well, it's kind of a trademark ability of Fluttershy's, and it's not really the greatest ability anyway. I put it in my bottom three, uh, honestly, for all the abilities together. And then Gamble was 
Well, I think it was probably taken away because because he was horribly abusive. Even right now at this level, if she's equipped with two earrings and you know all the best magic equipment, uh, magic boosting equipment available to her at the time, uh, she could probably do close to 4,000 points of damage to all enemies with uh, Philly Flash and Choco Bob. So yeah, very abusive. A little too much, perhaps. So, uh, yeah, and of course GP Rain was always kind of useless anyway, but yeah, let's go over some of these abilities that she can use here. Fight! Do I ever use it with any character besides Fluttershy and also outside of the Berserk Band? No! And it's even worse with Faust with her strength of 35. Uh, Magic Command. Very unique with Faust. Right now, she has... Oops. She has a lot of magic, but that's only because of the magic that Trixie, Tia, and Luna have. Her magic stat, or magic command, sort of like uh, how uh, is a, uh, or sort of like how Applejack's arts are dependent on Luna, or is dependent on whatever characters are in the currently in the party. So, if for example, Trixie has Cure and Bolt, and Celestia has uh, Fire and Poison. Uh, Faust will have all four of those abilities, so long as they're in the party. Um, let's see, the item command! Uh, always useful, so long as, you know, you're not like me and you hate to use items. I guess it's useful for Phoenix Down, at least, you know, if, you don't ha if you're not using the magic command. Uh, steel command, useful right now immediately it will be very soon as i'll show you later on uh, and useful you know however useful you think steel is up until you get apple bloom tools not so useful with uh, faust it's most of the abilities as you or tools as you know are based on physical abilities uh, her sh uh still what are those where are they at? oh they're right there cool yeah, uh, Noise Blaster, of course, is useful no matter what your stats are. Uh, we still don't care about Bio Blaster anymore at this point in the game. Med Kit is great for her, and Debilitator can be useful if you're fighting a boss with no weak point, which there are, what, like two at this point in the game from here on out, I think? <laughs> really? Honestly? And then, of course, one other tool that we don't have yet is arguably useful for her as well. Uh, otherwise, Bushido. If you really want to outfit her to be a strength character, I guess this can be sort of useful. If nothing else, the level 6 Bushido Divine Storm is very powerful with her, but then even if, even for AJ without a hero band, it can almost certainly kill your average random encounter anyway. So, yeah, plus there's a very select few weapons that Faust can even equip anyway to use it in the first place. So, yeah, I wouldn't recommend Bushido. And Satsu. Oh, and Satsu. Faust's ability to equip and Satsu is, in a way, kind of sad because she can use that and the magic command better than Luna since her magic stat is a little higher and she has access to at least two pieces of equipment that. Uh, you know, easily make her outshine poor Luna, who is, even stat-wise, is actually outclassed in every way except for defense and the fact that she can still be used as a substitute strength character. And something I realized I just forgot to say about Faust, she actually has the highest stamina rating of any character, if you actually care about that, and she also has the highest HP and MP of any character, interestingly enough. But yeah, poor Luna's kind of outclassed from this point on, uh, you know, with Faust in the party. It's kind of sad. Throw Command! Also interesting with Faust. Uh, uh, being able to throw uh, shurikens and weapons and whatnot is okay, but her real strength with throw is throwing scrolls, which are based on her magic stat, which is much higher than Fluttershy's. It's actually the second highest form of magic that you can uh, use right now, right off the bat if you get her first thing before anything else. Only other thing to say about throw. 
If, for some celestia forsaken reason, you decided to let Fluttershy die on the floating continent, Faust will not have access to the throw command. So, moving on. Unicorn! Sort of useful, I guess, in given as useful as it can be in whatever given situation. Uh, sorcery, also pretty good with Faust, really. Uh, she's better off mimicking it from rarity than actually using it herself most of the time, anyway. Draw command! Yeah. Don't use it. Whatever. Soar! Well, you know, it's, it's not a bad ability for her. There actually is one spear in the game that she can equip, which we currently do not have. I suppose it could have been more useful, except... You know, she can't use the Wonderbolt badge, so I wouldn't really use Soar. Dance. Oh, wow. This is just abusive with Faust. Her magic stat is much higher than Scootaloo's. She can do massive damage with Dance. Yeah, you. It's, a, it's definitely a good thing to consider. It's currently the strongest form of magic she has access to right now. Let's see, other abilities, last one, the random ability. This is the reason why she is easily the best character in the game. Anything Pinkie Pie can do, Faust can do way better. And for free, as a matter of fact. Even over the magic command, she can use these for free. The only thing she can't do better than Pinkie is Cat Scratch, which, frankly, sucks. For fouls. She can't do anywhere near the damage. She barely has any weapons that can, you know, we even warrant using it. So, but otherwise, she can do some really, really good damage with this, which is part of the reason we want to start, you know, finding abilities that are single target, even like Flare and Holy, which are not really, which are okay with Pinky, but are just crazy strong on fouls because she'll have access to spells early on that every other character can't use. So yeah, that's kind of her bread and butter. All right, do I want what else to steal? Random and I'll pick, pick something later. Let's go over her equipment real quick. She starts with this totally useless early game equipment, which is cool, I guess. Yeah, we're not gonna use it. And then she doesn't have any relics, I don't believe. Yeah. So otherwise, she has kind of a low armor class and weapon class in general, I guess. She she uses rods and quills and little else. She uses a couple of knives, like the mithril knife, it, which does not give her access to Bushido. In fact, I think there's only one weapon that I know of that can give, uh, give her access to Bushido if for some reason you actually want to use it. But yeah, she really uses rods. Wow, is this really all I have for her right now? Yeah, royal quill, that's why it's useful for her right now. Uh, I'll be getting something better shortly, though. She, uh, like anyone else, she has access to pretty much all the shields. It's, I just don't have much right now. I sold a bunch of stuff, so yeah. To uh, all the shields, also always good. Headgear, circlet. I think is the strongest. Yeah, is the strongest magic-based helmet she can equip besides the pointed hat. Otherwise, of course, the Gigi helmet is uh, good uh, strength-wise. She cannot equip the Oath Veil. And then armor body. This is her big thing. Tau robe technically is the best piece of armor she can equip. In fact, I personally think it's the best piece of armor she can equip. It's In this mod, it's not the most defensive piece of armor she can equip anymore. She can actually equip the diamond vest, which is kind of useless on her anyway, unless you want to equip her to be strength-oriented. And then there's also one other piece of armor that's much higher uh, defense and magic defense for her if she... Oh, why didn't I equip this? If she, uh, which I, we don't have yet, but we will soon enough. So, yeah, that's basically Faust for the moment. I'm going to be using her for a number of things right away, and then probably won't really be using her too much afterwards, just because she really is an a little too awesome, almost. <laughs> Maybe not overly abusive or anything, but, uh, yeah, I'll be limiting my use of her, unfortunately. Uh, so from this point on in the game, actually, I'm going to, uh, be trying to use characters, you know, evenly. I'm gonna try to keep all characters' levels as even as I can. 
uh, as I'm recruiting them and, and beyond. So, you know, I'm going to be trying to do that. And so I'm going to re-equip the party real quick, and then I'll be right back. Wow, I talked about Faust for 15 minutes. <laughs> well, I'm going to be talking about her for just a little brief time longer because, uh... One other thing, she's the other character who can equip the awesome Regal Crown, which is her best headgear, of course. And she can also equip a multitude of relics that not every pony can equip, like the Sneak Ring, for example. Or the Lucky Coin, even though she can't actually, you know, use Gamble and GP Rain. And, uh, other ones, the Sneak Ring, or, I just said that one, or is it the Thief Mark, so she can use Mug as well, and, uh, there's, a isn't there some other un- No, I think that's all the unique ones. But yeah, she has access to a couple of other ones. Anyway, now that I have Faust, there's my equipment set up, I guess. If you care, I've got her equipped with the Sneak Ring and the Wing Shoes. Because I'm going to go on a Stealing Spree, which Sorcery is going to help me accomplish. For some of my favorite equipment in the game, which starts right here on these planes, over here by the uh, Jurassic Park, Stay out of the dirt! I HATE the enemy that appears in the dirt! Crawler! Horribly annoying little jerk that poisons you like 80% of the time! I hate the little jerk! Oi! But right now we're looking for an enemy called Tumbleweed! Oh, there you are! Tumbleweed! There's four of them! Sort of dangerous, sort of not. Alright, first thing, Faust, Sorcery, and what am I looking for? Where is it? Discord! I think this works on them, doesn't it? I hope it works on him. Yay! Discord on that guy, because it lowers his level, and Luna's blind. And now I'm going to steal from him, which will be much easier than his level's been halved. Boom! Mm, no steal, huh? Okay, speed it up. I hope that didn't screw up the thing there. Steal! This is a rare steal, what I'm looking for, so this could take a while, even though I've halved his level. Couldn't steal, huh? Maybe I should equip rainbow bands for this. You know, just so we're not dying. I think I'll think about that in the next fight. Okay, this is gonna take a while, so... You know, I'll, whenever uh, I actually steal it, I'll come back. There it is! And I didn't realize that my magic was so, so low. Centurion! I'll go over that in a minute. I'm gonna steal uh, two more of those to get a total of three, and then I'll be right back. Okay then. <laughs> I got my Centurions. I've since wised up. I've actually healed and actually had MP for that ba for from here on out, and we're equipped with rainbow bands to uh, keep us safe. So next I want to actually go... Oh, and I, I ran away from that fight afterwards. I, you know, no grinding and all that. So, which I guess doesn't really matter since it wasn't worth that much. But yeah, now we're going here to the Jurassic Park to find a Tyrannosaur. Now, the Tyrannosaur actually could have dropped one of the pieces of equipment that I'm looking for, uh, that I'll be looking for with a different enemy, but I don't want to depend on that drop rate. Now, this guy is immune to Discord, so I'm just going to have to try to steal from him. But otherwise, let's go to Celestia real quick. And let's stop him in his tracks, shall we? That might be nice. And slow, that'll, uh... Oh, you know what? Yes, that doesn't work! Hey, I don't know everything. I know I, I, I pretend to, but I don't. Yeah, I'm just going to have to try to steal until it happens. Oh, if she already was set. Go, Faust. Steal, steal. I only need one of these darn... Th one huge shell. Thank you. Yay, I've got the item I wanted. Now get out of there. Get out of there. Yeah, I only want one of those. All right, so next, where am I going? I am going over to this continent right next door. The dirt still contains an annoying crawler jerk, but uh, it also contains two other creatures that I'm looking for. I think they actually appear outside of Miranda too, but anyway, next. Do, 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 do. This should be Gecko Rex, that uh, green guy in the front there. Uh, is he? Can I discord him? And I do not want that guy in the back there. Please don't jump before I can use Ice 2 on you. Ah, 
Aha! I can use Discord. That'll make things a little easier. Oh, he's kind of strong, isn't he? Oh, jerk. Alrighty. Stop on you. And stop on you. It'll stop you from hurting me for a little while. And steal already. Thank you. Couldn't steal, but okay. I wasn't paying attention. Did that do any damage at all? It, it looked like, from my peripheral vision, that it didn't do anything. Huh. Well, anyway, whenever I steal, I'll show it to you. Otherwise, I'll, you know, wait till I get back to it. There we go. Tortoise shield still takes forever. All right, that's the next piece of item I want. I'm going to get uh, three more of these. And uh, I'll be right back afterwards. Alrighty, I've gotten all my tortoise shields. Well, half of them anyway. I'm, if the next fight is those guys again, then good. But otherwise, the other enemies I'm looking for are also in this location. Alright, now I definitely have all four of the tortoise shields that I want. So, let's look for the other guy I'm looking for. There he is! Montadia! Two of them! Alright! Are, let's see, are, are you guys affected by stop? I'm sorry I didn't check this ahead of time. I really should have. I probably should get more MP, too. Oh, good. He's affected by stop. Let's just get you guys prepared. I need to put slow on them, and I might as well steal in the meantime. You can still do it without that, uh... Yeah, slow and stop helps a lot. But yeah, you, c you can still, uh... You still have a pretty good chance of stealing even without... Uh, using uh, Discord, but, you know, it just improves your odds a little bit. There it is! Man, that took over 20 tries! These guys are not affected by that uh, that one move. Uh, Discord. Oh, man. And particularly interesting about these Mantidias is that they have the highest attack rating of any random encounter in the game. So I'm going to get uh, the other demon spear that I want. Uh, and uh, I actually want a total of four, but I'll explain this long before that. Oh my gosh. I'll be right back. All right, I'll get the last two demon spears I want later. So what is all this equipment that I've just picked up? Well, this is the former imp equipment. It's no longer imp equipment. It's not even screwy equipment because it will not uh, enhance your power, uh, you know, extra if you are screwied. It's actually just flat out normal equipment now, although it still won't uh, equip if you use the optimum uh, option in your equipment. But this is all actually really good equipment. Some of the best in the game. Demon Lance here. Faust. This is the one spear that Faust can use. It doesn't have any elemental properties, but it has good stats. It actually has the best uh, magic power boost of any spear, I think. Actually, does it? Anyway, it only has, I think, like four points less than the White Lance, which is nice, right? Something like that. Yeah, it's only got four points less than the White Lance, and it's a great alternative if you need a uh, non-holy elemental weapon. Tortoise Shield! My favorite shield! I'm actually going to be picking, picking up a fifth one uh, later on. Let's just take a look at this in itself. Uh, where is she? See? Aegis Shield? Tortoise Shield! Everything the Aegis Shield is, but better, because it absorbs water. My favorite shield, even over these, it's barely weaker. Even over the Genji shield, which I could have right now if I traded in my uh, uh, Thunder Shields. Why don't I have any more Thunder Shields? Oh, that's why. Yeah, which could be better if I... Uh, yeah, even over that one, yeah, I think it's superior to the Genji shield. Uh, other other equipment then. Uh, we got Centurion, also absorbs water for all the physical base characters only. Has Good stats, some of the best there is. Uh, Luna there, Centurion. Uh, it's not quite as good as the Genji helmet or another helmet, but it's 
the so, uh, solution to the uh, helmet shortage in the game, in my opinion. It's a really good piece of equipment there. And then the last piece, huge shell. It's okay. Any pony can use it. Uh, absorbs water, and it has really good defensive stats, actually. De most balanced of any piece of armor, but for harsh lack of evasion and, to a lesser extent, speed, I, I don't like this as ultimate armor at all. I'm getting one for uh, a much later purpose, much, much later. In fact, the real reason is because fa this is the uh, next, the strongest defensive equipment that Faust can uh, use, which will be useful against uh, a certain enemy much later in the game. So, yeah, that's the, I guess you could call it turtle equipment now? Tortoise. Okay, whatever. Tortoise equipment. Anyway, yeah, this is, I'm going to get my last two demon spears, and then I'm going to continue with the quest next time on Let's Play My Little Pony Fantasy VI. Arrivederci.